हेलो गाइज वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल रिलीजियसली फिट वी आर गोइंग टू कवर सेकेंड वीडियो अबाउट न्यूट्रिशन लेबल्स एज आई टॉक्ट अबाउट इन आई माई लास्ट वीडियो इन दिस सीरीज सो वील बी कवरिंग वॉट इज अ न्यूट्रिशन लेबल सो वट एवर मार्केट वट एवर प्रोडक्ट यू सी इन योर सुपर मार्केट इट कम्स विद अ न्यूट्रिशन लेबल ऑन द बैक साइड ऑफ इट सो इफ यू गो टू थ्रू दैट न्यूट्रिशन लेबल यू विल गेट टू नो वॉट इज द सर्विंग साइज ऑफ दैट प्रोडक्ट हाउ मच अमाउंट ऑफ कार्बोहाइड्रेट फैट प्रोटीन फाइबर uh micronutrients like vitamin and mineral are there in that in that food so and how many calories so uh so the thing is if there's a product let's say it's of 500 grams on the back side of the nutrition label you see the serving size is like 100 grams so that means there are five servings of that food in that product 100 grams into 5 is 500 in that 100 gram of serving it will definitely tell you how many calories it has so let's say for simplification process let's say it has 100 calories so if you are going to consume that whole box you are going to get 100 into 5 multiplied by 5 which is 500 you are you are going to get 500 calories if you are going to consume one serving you are going to get 100 two servings 200 three servings 300 likewise okay so the serving size tells you how many calories you are going to get from that food uh, you can increase or decrease your serving size and you, thereby you can increase or decrease your calories as well so coming uh, like uh, getting getting into details uh, the, those calories are coming from you know carbohydrate fat and proteins so it will also tell you how much grams of carbohydrate fat and protein it has in the product in that carbohydrate it will tell you uh, it will tell you how much of that carbohydrate is sugar how much of that carbs is fiber in fats it will tell you how much of unsaturated saturated trans fat in protein it will uh, clearly tell you how much protein it has so okay, i'll create a new video uh, explaining different kinds of fats different kinds of carbohydrates for this video just stick to the names okay we'll stick to the names that's it so uh, let's say it ha- it tells you uh, protein it tells you 15 grams of protein per serving so that means in every serving you will get 15 grams of protein so in our case we have five servings which will equivalent to 500 grams so if we take five servings like if we consume the entire box so every serving has 15 grams entire box will have 15 multiplied by 5 which is 75 grams of protein for uh, for carbohydrate and for uh, fiber likewise it will tell you how much of it has in one and then you can multiply it according to your consumption so for carbohydrates you can go for complex carb as i said in my last video complex carb takes time to get digested in our stomach in our intestines instead of having sugary cereals which have more sugar if you go to the carbohydrate section you'll see fiber and sugar so in when you read sugar how much of sugar it has so go for the product which has less sugar and more fiber fiber is good for your gut and fiber is something uh, which you when you pass your stool so whatever comes out of your body is like all fiber so fiber has low calorie calorie calorific value uh, which makes us good for us it's good for our bacteria bacteria which are residing in our gut as well as it is good for us in terms of calorie okay so okay the next page is here so for fats we can uh, again uh, for fats as i said unsaturated saturated and trans trans fat is like uh, it's like extremely bad for your body extremely bad for your heart so go for Uh, go for products which doesn't have trans fat or which have like extremely exceptionally small amount of trans fat okay so whatever packaged food is there the coming is like be like burgers and all those things they have high amount of trans fat so unsaturated fats are healthier fats saturated fats are bad fats okay we'll cover this so a salad dressing made with olive oil is better than uh, better than a salad which has high amount of creamy dressings creamy dressings again will have more saturated fats and trans fats so opt for products which have more unsaturated fats okay coming to micronutrients like look for vitamins and minerals go for products like cereals for example which have high amount of vitamins and minerals in them a label might show 50% of your daily iron per serving so there are some fortified cereals which comes in the market Uh, they will tell you that if you have just one serving it will give you 50% of the daily iron needs of an adult so an adult uh, requires 2000 calories uh, it's this kind of standardization that has been done by the regulatory authorities so according to that 2000 calories uh, they have fixed the amount of carbs fats protein and minerals and vitamins 
so if every food label it has been prepared with respect to the these regulations so it will tell you how if it will tell you like for for example 25 percent of iron is there so it will tell you uh 25 percent means if you have like four servings you will get uh the iron uh, intake of that day okay again don't get confused like again i know this is overwhelming i create a new video explaining this in detail maybe i'll create couple of videos so that it will becomes clear to you so when we basically when we understand our food labels then we understand what we are putting in inside our bodies so then we know what what is coming into our body like basically what like is it good for our muscles is it good for our body is it good for our gut is it bad for our uh, heart health so when you when you start looking at nutrition labels you'll get to know that how good is that food for you okay every individual has a different need someone needs more calories someone needs more protein someone needs like babies infants they need more fat so it depends person to person so when you start educating yourself on nutrition labels you will make informed choices about your health so again if you like this video please subscribe to my channel because i'll be creating more more informative uh, more informative videos on nutrition and overall health which will definitely help you in feeling happier every day and i shall see you in your next one i hope you be well and see you soon bye bye